You do know my dad has a drinking problem, right? Of course I do. I didn't think people would be drinking tonight. I didn't plan on Chuck and Cheryl and the rest of the school crashing, okay? This was supposed to be just your friends. You and Archie are my friends, okay? Everyone else, including Kevin, including Veronica, are people that two months ago I would have actively shunned. Why? In case you haven't noticed, I'm weird. I'm a weirdo. I don't fit in and I don't want to fit in. Have you ever seen me without this stupid hat on? That's weird. Why are you getting so upset? It's just a party, Jug. It's not just a party. It's the fact that you don't know or even care that this is the last thing I would want. You did this for you to prove something. Thanks. To prove what? You're a great girlfriend. I don't know. <laughs> Doesn't it ever occur to you just how different we are? Like on a cellular DNA kind of level? You're a straight-A student. You're a cheerleader, for God's sakes. You're the perfect girl next door. I hate that word. I'm the damaged, loner outsider from the wrong side of the tracks. Betty, come on. Who are we kidding? We're on borrowed time. What the hell is that supposed to mean? Betty, I'm not one of your projects, okay? Like solving Jason's murder? No, you're not a project. You're my boyfriend. Until Jack. you're sick of slumming it with me? Or until Archie changes his mind and he says he wants to be with you? 